The Miccosukee Indian Tribe of Florida is right down on Alligator Alley, down by Naples. As you start across Alligator Alley, the very western end of Alligator Alley is where I found them. I had heard a story while up in Canada about the Miccosukees. Here is the story I got. I cannot find it on the internet, nor are the people willing to talk freely about it at this time. But I got to interview one elderly lady down there, a Miccosukee elder, who remembers the event. And the soldiers came to sweep the Miccosukee Indians out of the Everglades, out to Oklahoma. Well, they were one of the latter tribes that were taken out there, and they had already heard that there was no wooded land, hunting land, plenty of fresh water and grassy fields and woods to hunt in and plenty of game out there. They heard that it is nothing but what it is. It's a flatland desert, almost impossible to scratch a living out of, and many other nations had already been removed there and were well hated, the, the new arrivals. So they were going to die on the way there, leaving with nothing. So the Miccosukee, in force, moved their whole nation into the swamps and the reeds and the Everglades, along with the gators and the snakes and the spiders and the lizards and the frogs. And when the soldiers came to find them, and massive amounts of soldiers were sent there, the Miccosukee quieted all the children, but in the quieting of the children, they realized they could not silence the babies. So the Miccosukee women, when the soldiers came near enough to hear them, drowned their own babies to save the nation. And I'm wondering, how strong do you have to be to drown your own babies? And this is part of the Miccosukee story that I got from the elder. I couldn't find it on the internet, but I felt I had to share it with you.